Books for Buddies is a literacy program for disadvantaged youth that provides books and reading role models known as book ambassadors. With more than 70,000 books delivered through Northwest Ohio and the world, Books for Buddies has partnered with Toledo Public Schools, the Toledo Library, and the Toledo Museum of Art to host their annual block party. There will be free books, school supplies, vision screening, TPS kindergarten, and Head Start registration along with lunch. So please join us at Weiler Homes on July 31st from 1 to 2.30. You can find more information on this event and Books for Buddies on their Facebook page, Books for Buddies, or on their website, www.booksforbuddies.com. Today, I'm speaking with Christopher Smith, lead mentor with Books for Buddies. Hello, Mr. Smith. It's nice to meet you. Hello, Josh. It's so nice to meet you as well. So what can you tell us about the 2019 Back to School Block Party? The 2019 Back to School Block Party was just that, a big block party. We were here at Books for Buddies, the ambassadors passing out books, giving out string bags and other school supplies. The Museum of Art was here passing out books. Toledo Public Schools was here doing various activities as well as providing food. You know we have to have, you can't have a party without food, Josh. Also, we had TPS provided some music. Music, food, that's a party. The, the good addition was that we were able to pass out books. Who are some of the local organizations you've partnered up with in this event? For this event, as I mentioned, Toledo Museum of Art, this is the first time we had the privilege of working with them, and we hope this is the beginning of a long-standing relationship. Toledo Public Schools has been a, a long uh, sponsor and partner of us in the community. Wherever we are, usually they're there. Also, uh, Toledo Public Library. We could not be where we are without them. They give us a lot of uh, help. And um, I think that was all that was here with us today. Yeah. If someone would like to get more information on Books for Buddies, how can they do that? Go to our website, you know, www.booksforbuddies.com. Also, we have various events. You'll see them listed on the website. Come out to where we are. We would love to see you. Just as it's been a pleasure meeting you today. Well, thank you for your time today, sir. No problem. Hello, today I'm speaking with Bob Mendenhall here at the 2019 Books for Buddies Block Party. Hi, Bob. How are you today? I'm good. How are you? So, can you please tell us about the TPS Head Start and Kindergarten program? So, out here today, uh, we do five of these events over the course of the year. Uh, we go out, uh, people from the Board of Education, community partners, including Butts for Buddies, Toledo Museum of Art, Toledo Public Library, and others, all come out to these events to give back to the community and to showcase all the great things that we have going on here in Toledo Public Schools. What are some of the benefits of enrolling a child in the Head Start program? Well, you know, in the in the Lucas County area, it's uh, early intervention is key to be uh, prepared for kindergarten. So that we have the kindergarten registration out here today um, to uh, showcase to our families what the opportunities are within TPS to enroll in Head Start. If someone would like to know more, how or where can they find out? Uh, they can go onto our website, uh, tps.org, or they can contact uh, Dr. Amy Allen uh, at, at the Board of Education. Thank you so much for talking with me today. Thank you. Have a great day. Appreciate it. Today I am with Book Ambassador John Dulcie. Hello, sir. It's nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, too. So can you tell us um, why you became a Book Ambassador? I was actually recommended. One of my friends was um, in it before I was. He's a little bit older than I am. But I joined because I'm just a huge advocate for reading. Can you tell us some of the responsibilities as a Book Ambassador? Oh, uh, We go to events like these. We focus on book drives. We go to... Um, just things all over, all over around Toledo. And we do book drives, we collect books, and we just advocate reading throughout the city. In what ways do you feel you have been personally impacted by participating in this program? Well, I'm actually dyslexic, so kind of like getting other kids to read and kind of who may have dyslexia like I do but don't know it, and being able to push through that, because when I was younger it was real tough for me to read. But once I figured that out, once I just kept reading and pushing and pushing and learning, it just became a lot easier. And I just want to, I want to do that for others. Okay, well, thank you for your time today. Thank you. Thank you. Hi, can you tell us your name and your experience as a book ambassador? Hello, my name is Justin Teamer, and my experiences as a book ambassador are helping out people get access to books who don't have access to books. And right now, after this, I'm about to read some books to some people. Can you tell us about the event you are participating in today? This is a back to school event to people who don't have books during the summer we're going to give access to them and not only that but
people who have like the summer slump, people who don't read during the summer, we're going to encourage them to read during the summer also. What impact have you seen in the community through this program? I've seen a positive impact in the community because last year we had a raffle and a guy won the bike and now he improved in, he improved in his attitude and his reading scores insurmountably just because of this program. Okay, well, thank you for your time today. Thank you. Today I'm speaking with John C. Jones, Vice President of the Alpha Z Lambda Chapter of Alpha Phi Alpha Fraternity to talk about their participation in the Books for Buddies block party. Can you tell us about your organization? Absolutely. Um, we are a Greek letter organization. We're a fraternity. Um, and we are the first intercollegiate, which means undergraduate, college level, um, African American fraternity in the United States. So we were founded in 1906. Um, and locally, we were founded in 1928, our chapter. And we, our premise is around scholarship, uplift, building for uh, brotherhood, all those different things, and we work to try to build out community programs inside of our community. What was your motivation behind partnering with Books for Buddies? Well, we love children, so that's number one. So we believe that children are our future, they're also our present, and so our whole premise on our, all of our work in community is to give back to community and so not only do we think it's great to work with kids we also believe in education and scholarship and so helping them to learn how to read do better with reading is important and then we love Lenita and Bill Goings because we've been knowing them for a really long time and so it's outstanding to partner with good people in the community. How do you think Books for Buddies helps the community? That is a great question. Um, if we can teach our kids how to read, um, what you will learn, and you'll hear many people say this, is that as you're growing up from kindergarten to like third grade, you're learning how to read. But once you get past third grade, you have to read to learn. And so if our kids are not able to read at a high level, we know all the different things that that creates. And so we don't want to see more kids go to prison. We don't want to see more kids dropping out of school. We want to see kids with great jobs. And so if we can help them learn how to read and read better, we think we're doing a great job in community. Thank you so much for talking with me today. Thank you. This is outstanding. You did a great job. Okay, well, thanks for helping me cover the event. Thank you for having me. This is Joshua Danforth and Angela Ernsberger reporting, reporting for, for the, the Parisburg Digital, Digital Media, Media Club. Club. So can you tell us your name? Lele. And why did you come out here? Uh, to get some books. And the most important question, are you a zebra? You are. That's pretty awesome.